My name is Eamon Hickey. I come from Tipperary in Ireland. In Ireland I competed um, on the European Championships in, for ponies and juniors and jumping. When I came to Sweden I competed a lot of uh, uh, show jumping and gradually people asked me to help them with their young horses that had problems. Breeding today has changed so much. We breed much more sensitive horses with more blood and because of that a lot of top riders in eventing, jumping, dressage leave their horses to me to educate it and to start their young horses. My philosophy is to have a red line from the start to the end to keep the horse confident, focused and relaxed. Now is to work with the saddle pad again, like we have done in, in the stable. And again to the same repetition, the same, same exercises. It's quite windy here. And again, that's very good training for the horse. You can rub here everywhere in a rhythm. In the end, we should just be able to throw this on and off here. Come forward here. Even we should be able to rub the horse between the eyes here with this. I should be able to throw the pad on here in a relaxed way. If the horse is nervous, I keep working with the pad. And then this saddle should be just a simple step. If the horse is nervous from this, we take it off and we work more with the saddle pad. So here without the girth, we ask the horse to step around. Again, the horse will step under with its inside hind leg. Not very good. Reward in the middle. And we'll do the same on this side. And I, get, I, get, I keep my inside hand on the, by the head collar, my outside hand on the saddle. So if something happens, I'm in safety here. Good, and reward. And then the horse knows when he stands here, it's gonna get a reward. We should be able to move the saddle around. If the horse is nervous, we take the saddle away and we work with the pad again. This is the girth, and we're just gonna, even we can just rub the horse with this in the beginning. When I take the girth, it's always better for me to go with my left hand, massage down here, and here, so I can push myself away. If the horse was to kick me with a hind leg, I can keep myself back up. And again, in episode one, we had the rope around the horse's belly. So it's used to that contact there. If it's afraid of that contact, we, go, we don't go to the next step. And now the saddle is on, I keep my hand in the same place here, but on the horse and ask the horse to step around. So it's doing exercises it's done before. Reward. Ask the horse to step sideways and then just give and take softly with the lead rope. Very good. Even with the saddle on, the horse should be able to back four steps. One, two, three, four. Reward. Even massage up here again. So it's good to stand on the inside and rub a lot on the outside. Tighten the girth one hole. Ask the horse to step around. Come forward. Reward. I can take a deep breath again that I am calm. Step around. So this would be the way I would normally introduce a saddle. And if I do my steps correctly, it should go like this. If it doesn't go like this, I must go, uh, go back a step or two steps or go back to the very beginning if it's needed. So it all comes out to at the be gymnastic at the horse stretches right and left goes forward goes backwards one two three four and reward and has focus 
If the horse makes a mistake, it's important that directly you change the mistake to, to an exercise. Okay, so from this, the next step then would do a little lunging with the saddle on. So we'll ask the horse to move out, show the way. Forward. 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 Forward, have a light contact. Just give and take softly with the lead rope. And the goal is that we have a little bend to the inside. There's a little licking and chewing with the mouth. And now I'm going to go backwards and ask the horse to follow me. Very good. And reward. We can rub on the, the hocks, rub under the belly, and we go backwards and stop. So the horse knows when I step backwards, it's going to get a reward and relax. And again, for day one, this would be enough with the saddle on. But what we'll do, the horse, what we'll do anyhow, we'll do a little more. We can take down the stirrups. There's one. Stop. Reward. We'll take down this stirrup. Step around. We can ask the horse to back four steps. One, two, three, four. Reward. Ask the horse to step out and go forward. 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 Good. And I'll go backwards and stop again. Whoa. So with a very light contact, we can get the horse to stop and follow. There was a deep breath. We go on the right, show the way with my right hand. Move out, move out, move out. Good. Forward. Okay, and we'll go backwards and stop. Very good. And now the horse is even waiting for this reward. When the horse looks over there, we, for sure, well, we try to correct the horse and get it straight. And when the horse is in line, reward. But if the horse was to go like this, and I, if I was to rub the horse, it would be wrong. It's important that I get the focus, then reward. When the horse is very relaxed and following in a good way, these exercises, the next step will be getting on. And this, again, we re before we get on, we repeat these exercises, get the horse to stretch and follow. And from the inside again, we rub the outside. Have a little bend to the inside and very much rubbing on the outside. From here, I will hold with my inside hand on the neck and just put my foot up and down. And then from that little exercise, rub again here and around again. Sometimes we feel we must get on in a, and we, we get stressed. So it's very important that, that the horse is with us. We do the same. We ask the horse to step around here. Ask the horse to stretch. Very good. Reward, even just lift up my right foot here and then down again and then around again. Again, if there's the smallest problem, we should go back a step. There the horse relaxes, put my foot up and just bounce here, bounce, bounce and then down again and we'll step around again. In a rel all this stretching and turning helps relax the horse. And you can see the horse just stretches down and relaxes. And we do the same on the right here. Let's turn again. And we ask the horse to follow me this time. Very good. Reward. And when I get on, I would like a little bend to the inside. Bounce. There, the horse was super there. Keep my balance here. And from this position, I can get off if I want. 
Now I decide to get off and we'll go around again and reward. We'll turn to the right, follow, good. Put in the stirrup, keep my balance, and then down again. Very good. And go around again. Stop, reward. And we can mix this work with uh, normal lunging. My balance here. If we're not comfortable with this, it's important we train with an old horse. Keep my balance and then down again. And there the horse stood still. Very good. In the next episode, we will show how we get on for the first time and Cavaletti work, lunging Cavaletti work. So see you then. Thank you.